Okay, getting my screen set up. Okay, <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Hello everyone, I'm Mark and I'm here with you for another live stream class, yay! Before I do anything, I need to know if you can see me and hear me. If you can see me and hear me, please say yes in the chat so that way I know everything is a-okay. One more time, if you can see me and hear me, please say yes in the chat so that way I know everything is a-okay. I want to see a Y-E-S. Okay, Helga, thank you so much. All right, Ava, hello, hello. Alfana, you are not late. We are just starting today. We are just starting, so you are not late. You are here at the right time. Okay, thank you, Lolly. Hello, green team. Thank you, thank you. Hello, Lolly. Mwah. Ava, hello. Mwah. Yay, the green team is in the house. Who else is here? So it's right now we got Lolly and Ava from the green team. Yes. And I also see Helga. Hello, Helga. And Gosh is here. Hello, Gosh. Alfana, hello. Kadeen, how are you doing? Fitzma, hello. All right, some names I can't pronounce. I can't read. I'm sorry about that. Javi, April, okay, nature photo, hello, Ketli, hello, Jojo, all right, all right, Mariano, hello, the green team is coming in, Mariano, hello, hello, okay, hello, Thu, all right, well, what we always do, we always have a toast to start our class, right, so we always have a toast for good luck, so let's do that, so Please get your beverage. Mine is coffee as usual. So pick up your beverage, pick up your glass, pick up your cup, pick up your mug, whatever you are drinking out of, please pick it up for our toast. Our first toast is to the green team. Yes, the supporters, they support me. They support the channel. By supporting me and the channel, they are supporting everyone. So let's give the green team, yes, the people, you see their names in green. Let's give them a big thank you. Thank you, green team. If you don't have a beverage, we can fist bump, bump, cheers, bump, cheers. Yes, and because we had a toast, we have to have a drink. Bottoms up. Mm. Ah, all right, now, oh, Marion's here. All right, good, Marion's here. How are you doing? All right, for our second toast, it's for you. Yes, you are here. Without you, there's no reason for me to be here. No, nope. without you, there's no reason for me to be here. So let's give a big toast to you. Let's give a toast to a fun, interesting, informative, and productive lesson today. Cheers, bump, cheers, bump. And because we had a toast, we have to have a drink. Bottoms up. Ah, okay, now let's talk about today. Yes. Today is Monday here in Japan, 11 a.m., and this is not a usual time, no. Um, and today we're going to do an, uh, a worksheet. And so normally we don't do that, but I have some free time because of summer break. So let's do a worksheet, yeah? And you can get the worksheet at the community page, yeah. So there's a link above, I, I pinned the link. So you just go to the community page, you go to my uh, YouTube home page, and then you can, there's, there's um, different links, right? We have home, video, playlist, community. So you hit, you go to the community page, and there you will see this worksheet, and you can just drag it from the community page to your desktop. All right. If you don't, that's okay because I'm going to show you. All right. So if, if you can get it yourself, that's great. If you can't, that's okay because I'm going to show you so you can see it closely. Oh, I, sh I forgot. I should put it right on the screen. Oh, okay. Let me do that. Ah, see, I don't normally do this. And so, um, I forgot to do that. So let me, I'm going to go ahead and put the worksheet right on the screen. So please be 
patient with me for one minute here, okay? I need to get this on. So give me, it shouldn't take me very long at all. I just have to locate the worksheet and put it on the screen. And where is it? Oh, I should have done this before. I'm sorry. I, need, I forgot to do this. Okay, I see it. I see it. I see it. Okay. There it is. Oh, boy. <laughs> you don't see me, do you? Okay, I, I, have, I have to fix this. Okay. Oh, okay. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, no. Okay, hold on. Hold on. This, this is interesting. Okay, okay. Uh, image. No. Okay, is this, how is this going to work? Oh, oh no. I'm doing this on the fly. Hold on. <laughs> oh, what is going on? Okay, I know. I know what I'm doing. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. I got to do, hold on. I'm so sorry. Let's see. Um. Okay, I think we want to go like that. Uh-oh. Okay. Oh. Woo. <laughs> Woo. Oh, I'm sorry about that. That was, I did this on the fly. I did it just now. So sorry about that. Well, here is the worksheet. Yeah. So we got the worksheet. So you can see it for yourself right there. And... Um, as we, <laughs> as we talk about it, I will make it smaller. Okay. So that is the worksheet right there. Um, all right. So we're doing the worksheet. We'll be here for one hour. All right. We'll be here for one hour. And so, um, welcome. And this is which one doesn't belong. And so, uh, there are three, whoops, whoops. We have three steps, yeah, we have, well, we have three steps. Step one, step two, step three, and we have two groups. We have group one, group two, all right? So these are the, the two main groups, and then we will um, practice writing sentences based on these two groups. And our topic is phobia, phobia, phobia. So actually, this is pretty interesting, right? So let me, let's talk a little bit about phobias, all right? So I'm going to write on the screen what a phobia is and some common phobias, okay? And, and some common phobias, let me, let's go like this. Okay, here we go. Okay, so let's talk about some common phobias. So first, okay, phobia... Phobia is a type of anxiety. So it's a, a type of anxiety. So anxiety is uneasiness. So you're not comfortable. You don't feel comfortable. You, you, you feel tense. You feel nervous you feel scared, right? Anxiety and anxiety. So phobia is a type of anxiety caused by excessive, excessive fear. So um, excessive is more than normal, more than normal. Okay, hey, Air Lady is here. Air Lady, hello, hello. Air Lady, welcome to the green team. Yep, Air Lady, welcome to the green team. Air Lady is a member now of the green team. Hello, Air Lady. Okay, cheers, cheers, Air Lady. Let me have, we had um, a little cheer, so I need to take a drink. Cheers. So we're talking about, we are talking about phobia. So a type of anxiety where you don't feel comfortable, you feel 
nervous, you feel stress, you feel fear. And it's called by, so um, the anxiety is caused by the fear, okay? And we have some common, common phobias, yeah? So we have, and these are difficult words. These are difficult words. We have glossophobia, glossophobia. That is fear of public speaking. So glossophobia. Glossopho glossophobia. Okay, glossophobia, that is the fear of public speaking. So fear of public speaking. So does anybody in the chat do you get nervous when you are speaking in public? Like if you have to give a speech or if you have to give a presentation, do you have glossophobia? Do you have a fear of public speaking? I think many people do. I think many people do. Um, Jorge says, phobia to needles is not acceptable this year. Good, yeah. Jorge, we all need we all need the needle. That's right. That's a good point, Jorge. Ah, oh, gosh, gosh's children are scared of clowns. So, anybody have a fear of public speaking? Rachel says, "Yes, I have." Ah, oh, Kayleen says, "Me too." Ah, oh, Air Lady says, "Sometimes a little bit." Yeah. So. Right. I think it's hard not to when you're speaking in front of many people and they're listening to you. They're, I get nervous, yeah. <laughs> Ava says, yes, I have. So I think many people have this glossophobia. Gloss, glossophobia. Glossophobia. Mean says, not me. Uma says, yes, I have. Okay, interesting. Okay, how about, here's another one. How about... Um, acrophobia, acrophobia. So, acrophobia. Acrophobia is the fear of heights. So acrophobia is the fear of heights. So do you get nervous when you're in high places, like a tall building, something like that? Do you have acrophobia? Acrophobia? Y yes. So um, Muzda, yes. I think, too, I think it's also um, very common. Yes. So public speaking is... Um, a phobia that many people have, I'm sure. Okay, so Ava, Ava does not have acrophobia. She is not scared of heights. Rachel, oh, Air Lady says, yes, I do. So Air Lady has a fear of heights. Ah, Lolly, also, me too. I have acrophobia. So Helga, a little. So I have acrophobia, a little. Uh, mean, you have a fear of needles. That is um, tripanophobia, tripanophobia. Okay, Vicky says yes. Vicky does not like heights. She does not like high places. Okay, good. Um, okay, here's another one. How about this? Let me... Oh, agrophobia. Agrophobia. Now this is, this one can be really, so agrophobia is the fear of leaving your home. So 
Uh, agrophobia is the fear of leaving your home. So those are like, we say maybe shut-ins. There's another word like shut-ins. Um, they don't like public spaces, right? So agrophobia is the fear of leaving your home um, to be like in a public space. So agrophobia, fear of leaving your home um, to be in a public space. To be in a public place. So this can this can be um, a big problem, right? So I don't know, like like glossophobia, right? Public speaking, you you don't have to do that, right? You don't have to do that. Um, acrophobia, you don't have to go to the top of the building, right? You don't have to do that. However, um, agoraphobia, that is terrible because you don't want to be in a public space. You want to stay home, and that's not good, right? We have to go to our work. We have to have a job. You have to go to the, to the market to buy food, right? So um, this is, this is a, a terrible one, and many people, we, we, we call them like shut-ins, you know, they don't leave their home, right, shut-ins. So, you're like, you're, you're in your, you, you don't want to leave your house. Yeah, so good. So, yeah, so, um, let's see, Mariano, no, I haven't. That's good. So, we don't want to be, we don't want agoraphobia. Oh, I have acrophobia, the fear of heights. Alfana, I don't have any phobias. Good. Eva, no, I don't have agrophobia. Good. Right? Because you have a job, you go, you leave your house, you travel, you go on vacation, Eva, right? Ah, uh, Helga, that's a little different, right? That that's good. Helga says, I have an agrophobia, but I am lazy sometimes to leave my home. Yeah, so there, there's times I want to stay home. I don't want to go to the supermarket, right? I, I mean, I don't like crowded areas, right? I don't like going to the shopping mall. I don't like crowds. I don't like to go to a place where there's many, many people, but I don't have a fear. I'd just rather not. <laughs> I prefer not to. Okay. Uh, so lots of people have acrophobia, fear of heights. For sure. So Lolly says, um, agoraphobia is a handicap in life. It is. Like people who, who are handicapped, maybe they can't walk or, you know, they, they have some disability. This is a disability, right? agoraphobia is definitely a disability, right? If you can't leave your home, that, that's a disability for sure. Yeah, Marion. Okay, good, good, good. So these are some, and, and there's social phobia. We have um, astrophobia. Astrophobia is the fear of storms, you know, like um, bad weather. We have Tripanophobia, fear of needles. Um, xenophobia, fear of dogs. We have entomophobia, fear of insects. And claustrophobia, claustrophobia, um, fear of enclosed spaces. I kind of, I have a little bit of claustrophobia. I have a little bit of that. Like, I do not like taking the elevator. I always use the stairs. Um, yeah, I don't like tight. I do not like Ferris wheels. I do not like Ferris wheels. I don't want to be enclosed in a small space. So I'm, I have a little bit of, of um, claustrophobia. So I'll write one more. Claustrophobia.
claustrophobia, and that's the fear, fear of enclosed, enclosed spaces. Claustrophobia, fear of enclosed spaces. So I'm a little bit claustrophobic. I'm a little claustrophobic. And um, I do not like elevators. I do not like Ferris wheels. <laughs> I, 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 so I never take the elevator. I always take the stairs. And actually, I like, I like taking the stairs. I like getting some exercise. So I don't do... I don't do elevators. No, I don't. Oh, okay, good, air lady. So, okay, let's get to the let's get to our um, our worksheet. Okay, so right. Wait, I'm going the wrong way. We're, let Let's do the worksheet. Okay, let's do the worksheet now. Oh, Ava says, um, I think I don't have any phobia. Maybe a little old. Um, flying, I don't like it, but I have sometimes have, yeah, airplanes, I don't like it either. Okay, so I'm going to, um, I'm going to make the handout bigger now, okay? There, oh, we're making it bigger. Yes, we are. Okay, there it is. So, here we go. We have, here's our first group. So, um, which one doesn't belong? Which one doesn't belong? Scanner. What, what is scanner? Claustrophobia for me. What, what is scanner, Lolly? Yeah, Helga says a little bit of claustrophobia too. Yep. Yeah, I, I don't, I want to take the stairs. I don't want to be in an elevator. Hey, m &S, how are you doing? Okay, let's, um, Let's do the first group. So we have group one, right? We have group one, and group one is clowns, spiders, school, and flying. One more time. Clowns, spiders, school, flying. Which one doesn't belong and why? Which one doesn't belong and why? Yeah, air lady. I always do, oh, MRI scan, ah, okay, yeah, yeah, in the machine, gun, gun, gun. I had to do that once. I had, when I had my, um, when I had my hernia surgery, they put me in an MRI, and it's like, gun, 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 that terrible sound. Yeah, that's not fun. Okay, so, um. Helga, I think flying is different because it is useful, pleasant, and expensive. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so here we go. Okay, uh, Lolly's on the board here. Okay, let's... Uh, hold on, I need to, like, fix the... Let me... Oh, I need to fix... Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. This, this is not working the way I want it to. Okay, we're putting it down a little bit here. Okay, so here we go. We're putting it down. Okay, so we have four things. Yeah, we have clowns, spiders, school, and flying. Which one doesn't belong and why? Okay, so of the four, which one doesn't belong and why? So remember, I always give this example, right? So we have blue, pink, bicycle, purple. Blue, pink, bicycle, purple. Which one doesn't belong? Bicycle, because it's not a color, right? So bicycle does not belong because these three are colors, okay? So the same, we're doing the same thing here. Our four things, clowns, spiders, school, flying. Which one doesn't belong and why? Okay, let's see. So with group one, Let's see, we got, yeah, air lady, I do not like elevators. I don't have, I don't have a, I don't say I'm, I don't, I'm not, 
uh, I don't have a phobia, but I just prefer not to. I usually don't. Helga says, um, I think flying is different because it is useful, pleasant, and... Okay, I understand now. Okay, okay, sorry, sorry, Helga. Helga has flying because... The reason, because it's useful, pleasant, and expensive. Where clowns maybe are not very useful, spiders are not very useful, school is useful, right, Helga? School is useful, but it's not expensive, right? Well, university is expensive, but elementary school is not expensive. Let's see, lollies on the board. Clowns, because they are human beings. Oh, very good. Spiders not humans. School is not human. School is a institution. It's a building, right? And flying is not, well, um, an airplane is not a person, but a clown is a person. Oh, Sewu's in, in the house. Hello, Sewu. Mwah. How you doing, Sewu? Okay, let's see. Kadeen says, I think spiders because um, it's not made by man. Oh, very good. Clowns are, right? We are people. School is built by people and airplanes are built by people. Yeah, very good. Nice one. Nice one, Rachel. Was that Rachel? No, that was Kayleen. Sorry. Rachel says, I think spiders do not belong with the others because they are animals. Good, good. Walla, because there is no fear in school. Uh, some people, I don't know, Walla, I think people have a phobia about school. I think there's a, a school phobia. I think so. Um, Sewu, clowns, because they can disguise many characters. Or they can become many characters. How about that? So clowns, because they can become many characters. Okay, say we one more time. Clowns, because they can become many characters. Lolly says flying, because there's no S in it. Clowns have an S. Spiders have two S's. School has an S. Flying, no S. Very good. Okay. Ava, a spider, because it's an animal. Good. Marion, I think the clown, because they are human beings. Very good. Okay, Rachel, I think um, a, a board does not belong with the others because it belongs in a school. Oh, oh, okay, oh, Rachel, the, this is actually a symbol of school. So the board, it's like a, a, a blackboard, right, A, B, C. So it's, it's a symbol of school. So you should say um, school. So we're, we're doing, so the four topics are Clowns, spiders, school, and flying. So the pictures are just representations. So representations. It's giving meaning. So the, the pictures um, give meaning to the word. Meaning or understanding, right? So you see the picture and you can understand the word. Ah, Min says spider because it's a pest. Very good. Yeah, I mean, kindergarten is inexpensive. Here in Japan, kindergarten is expensive. Kindergarten is private in Japan, and it's quite expensive. But elementary school and junior high school is not. High school starts to get more expensive. And then university is very expensive. Okay, so... Um, so Umesh says, school because students gather there. School because students gather there. Very good. Sewu, um, become many characters. Yes. So clowns because they become many characters. Clowns because they become many characters. Pennywise is a clown. That's right. That's Stephen King. That's a Stephen King story. 
Marion, I think school because it's a building. Good, good, good. Yep, those others are not buildings. Very good. All right. So my answer, let's see. My answer is, um, let's see. My answer will be, I will say school because I think less people have phobia with school. So I think many people have a phobia of clowns. I think many people have a phobia of spiders. I think many people have a phobia of flying, but I don't think there are too many people who have a phobia of school. So my answer is school. But remember, there are no wrong answers. There are no wrong answers. It's what you think. It's your opinion. It's your idea, right? <laughs> so Lolly likes clowns. Okay, let's do our... Oh, okay, Ava says clowns because they make us happy. They make us happy. I don't know. When I'm flying, I'm happy because I'm going to like see my family. So for me, um, flying makes me happy. I can say, okay, that's my answer. Clowns make me sad. I don't know why. Clowns make me sad. Spiders kind of make me feel creepy. Um, I don't know. I guess school makes me happy too. So I I'm going to stick my first, so sorry, cross that off. Forget it. I'm going to use school, my original answer. Okay, let's go to group two. Okay, I'm going to um, put this up here so we have a better look. I'm going to blow it up just for now. Okay, so here we go. We have a gun. We have a dental drill. We have a needle. Let me stretch it out here. Oh boy, that's really stretched. Okay, here we go. One more time. We have a gun. We have a dental drill. We have a needle and blood. One more time. A gun. A dental drill. A needle and blood. Which one doesn't belong and why? Which one doesn't belong and why? So, can you tell me your sentence? Please write your sentence in the chat, just like Lolly just did. Lolly just did that. Lolly says, a gun because it's made to kill. Yeah, it's made to kill, Lolly. It's made to kill. Good one. Kayleen says, I think a gun because it's not used in doctor's offices. Oh, very good. Yes, dental drills are in a um, doctor's office, right? A doctor of dentistry. We have a needle that's used by doctors and blood. You will see blood in doctor's offices. Very good, but not a gun. No, <laughs> no, no, no. Very good, Kadeen. Okay, um, Helga. Blood, because it is a liquid fluid. Very good. See, you guys have great answers. You guys always have great answers. Okay, let me get my screen. So, oh, my screen is... Okay, that's better. I think that's better. Let's see. Okay. Okay. We're back. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I know what I have to do. Okay, okay, okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It went away. Okay, there it is. Oh. Oh. I can't move the picture now. I almost, I'm moving my... my my screen. Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay, back to the chat. <laughs> back to the chat. Okay, here we go. Oh, Uma says, blood, it is red. Cebu says, I think guns because it kills people. The three items save people. Yes. So if you are... If you have a terrible toothache, you need that dental drill. If you have 
a, um, a problem and you need medicine, maybe you need a, a needle. And if you are losing blood, you need more blood. Yes, yeah, so those will save your life, not a gun. A gun will not save your life. Okay, Ava says, a gun because it's for killing. Yes, yes, okay, good. Uh, Rachel, I think gun because it's allowed, it, a gun because it's not allowed in a hospital. Okay, Rachel, good, good, good. A gun because it is not allowed in a hospital. Good. Lolly, gun because there's no D in it. Let's check it out. Dental drill, there are two D's. Needle has one D and blood has a D. Gun does not have a D. Nope. Marion, I think the gun because it's an object made to kill. Very good. Helga, a dental drill because almost everybody is afraid of it from childhood. Yes. <laughs> Don't. I, I hate that sound, like, oh boy, yeah, I don't like it. So, if you don't like the dental drill, then take care of your teeth. Yes, don't eat sugar, brush your teeth, use dental floss, stay away from the dental drill. Yes, you can stay away from the dental drill by taking care of your teeth. <laughs> All right, Esther. Hello, Esther. Esther says blood because it is life. Very good. Ava, uh, blood because it it it's made to. Mm, let's see. How can we say this, Ava? Blood because I, I think Esther said it best. Blood because it is life. I think that is a good way to say it. So. So, Ava, just like Esther, blood, because it is life. Lolly, blood, because it's liquid inside the body. Yes. Mean, a needle, because it can save people's lives. Yeah, but mean, blood can do that too. Okay, Air Lady says, I think blood, because the other three make holes. Oh, Air Lady, I like that answer. Very, very good. Yes, a gun will make a hole in your body. A dental drill will make a hole in your teeth. And a needle will make a hole in your skin. But not blood. No. Nope. Very good. But blood will come out. <laughs> right? Okay, that's a good one. Here, lady. Helga, a gun because we don't... We don't see it in our everyday life. Good. But Helga, I don't see a dental drill in my everyday life. I don't see a needle in my everyday life. And actually, I don't see blood in my everyday life. I mean, it's, I know we have blood, it's inside, but I don't really see it. I, don't, I guess, right, this is blood. So, uh, yeah, I guess, you know, blood we, we see in our body every day, yeah. Okay. Ah, oh, Sewu. Sewu says blood because I have it. <laughs> I do too, Sewu. I have it too. I have blood too. Very good, Sewu. I like it. Marion, blood because it is red. Walla, I think a gun because all the others use in dental care. Oh. Interesting, yes. Dental care, yes. Of course, dental drill, but a needle, right? We um, dentists use a needle to put Novocaine in our to so we don't feel the pain, and also um, blood, right? And, and the, you know, blood comes out when we're a lot of times when we're at the dentist. There's blood, right? There's blood. Not too much, but there's blood. So very, I like it. That's a good one, um, Walla. Good one. Yeah, Air Lady. That's a. That's a. That's actually my favorite answer so far. Um, blood, because it doesn't make a hole. Very good. That was a good one. 
Yeah, Ava, blood because it is life. Oh, Esther, very interesting. But I don't know, the dental drill is pretty thin. But maybe, yeah, okay, yep, yeah, that's the thinnest. Yeah, I, I, for sure I would say needle is thinner than the dental drill. Yep, yeah, okay, good one. I like it, Esther. Esther says, the needle because it is the thinnest object. So I, that's a good one. Lolly, blood because we can live, we cannot live without it. Um, wait, wait, no, no. Blood because we can live, no, we can live without the gun. Uh, we can't live without it, right? So blood because we cannot live without it. So that, that's true, right? With no blood, no life, right? So blood because we cannot live without it. Oh, Ava says, a dental drill because it needs electricity. Yeah, that's right. Very, very good. Okay, let's do our um, sentences now, okay? So everyone had some great, great um, answers. Now let's go to step two, shall we? Step two. Now, let's look at step two. Let's read the directions. Actually, I'm going to... I need to um, fix this. Hold on, hold on. I need to do something. Sorry. I need to fix because the the paper just keeps um, it, it just keeps stretching. I don't want it to stretch. Okay, I think I fixed it. Maybe. Ah, uh, I should. Okay, something's going on here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna. Okay, I think I got it now. Okay, no. Ah, oh, this is difficult. Okay, well, let's let's read this together. Okay, so we're gonna do step two, writing. So I'm gonna read it to you. What what we're going to do? Step two is. Write sentences that include three items that belong in the same group. So remember, we, we talked about which one doesn't belong, right? So, so for example, many people said um, spiders. No, no, many people said clowns because they are human, right? So if you said clowns because they are human, that means you need to make a sentence using the three others. So you need to send spider school flying, right? So let's do that, for example. Okay, so part two, we have to write, we have to include three things that belong together in one sentence. One more time. Three things that belong together in one sentence. So for example, like my first example, blue, pink, bicycle, purple. Bicycle doesn't belong right? Because it's not a color. So now we have to use um, blue, pink, purple in one sentence, right? So I like blue, pink, and purple, okay? So I like the colors blue, pink, and purple. That's one sentence, the three items, the three, the three things in one sentence. So for example, group one, if we say clowns because they are humans, that means we have to use spider, school, flying in one sentence. Let's see, did anybody do it? Marion says, at school, clowns can wear masks to represent spiders. <laughs> Marion did it. Let's see. Lolly says, spider, school, and flying are not human beings. <laughs> Lolly did it. Okay, let me do my... Oh, Ava says, many clowns go to school and he has spider clothes. Okay, yes, you did it. Okay, let me see if I what I can do. Spider school flying. Let's see, this is um, step two. Can you see? Okay, step two, and my sentence is going to be... Um, 
the school, or we could say, how about this school? I'm going to use this, this school. Uh, oh, no. Okay. Okay, let's see. I'm going to say, no, oh, I, I'm, let me see. Okay, I, I'm going to say this school This school teaches people about spiders and this school teaches people about spiders and um, flying things. <laughs> I don't know. That's kind of a, a strange sentence. Uh, mine is, this school teaches people about spiders and flying things. <laughs> okay. Ava says, okay, I read Hel uh, Ava's. Helga, some pupils invent such jokes at school that any clowns that any clowns do fly or not. Okay, let me see. Helga, some pupils, some pupils invent such jokes at school like clowns fly or do not fly. Umesh, clowns, spiders, flying entertainment people. <laughs> okay, <laughs> how about this? Flying clowns, how about flying spiders and clowns entertain people at school? Because we need school. No, 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 that's right. You got the three things, sorry. Um, let, let's see. Clowns, flying clowns and spiders entertain people. Clowns and flying spiders entertain people. Good night, gosh. Air lady, before the dentist could drill out the cavity, he, need to, he needed to give the patient a needle for pain. After work, he wanted to buy a gun for protection. Good, good. But, okay, air lady, we're doing uh, group one. So we're doing step two, group one, air lady. This is, so let, group one. So, Air Lady, please make a sentence using three things in group one. Let's see, Sewu says, the clown showed the students a spider show at school. Oh, I like it, Sewu. Very good. I like that one. Min says, a clown used to go to my school and he always brought with him a water gun. Okay, but mean, those are our, our, our four things are clowns, spiders, school, flying. Lolly says, when I was flying to school, there was a spider hidden in the corner of a plane. <laughs> wow, Lolly used to fly to school. That's great. <laughs> Good sentence, Lolly. Rachel says, I do not like spiders, clowns, and flying things. Very good, Rachel. I like it. One more time. Rachel says, I do not like spiders, clowns, and flying things. Very good. Kayleen says, the clowns will be late for school performance because they missed the flight. They missed their flight time. How about this? Kayleen. The clowns will be late for the school performance, for the school performance, because they missed their flight. They missed their flight. Ava, when I was flying, there were many spiders and clowns too. <laughs> That's scary. That's a scary flight. Okay, good, Air Lady. Let's see your sentence. Okay, there, I see it now. Air Lady says, the clown played with history spider as he was flying.
flying to Japan. Okay, okay, how about, you don't need history. Air Lady, this is a good sentence. The clown played with the spider as he was flying to Japan. That's a good one, Air Lady. One more time. The clown played with a spider. The clown played with a spider as he was flying to Japan. As he was flying to Japan. Very good. Helga. Mark, what about my sentence about spiders? Hell, God, let me, I didn't see your sentence about spiders. I gotta go back. Oh, I see it now, Helga. Spiders learn to knit their net or fly in their autumn in their spider's school. Okay, good, good, yeah, so spiders have their school. Um, spiders learn to knit their net or fly in their autumn air, in the autumn air. Spiders learn to knit their net or fly in the autumn air in their spider, spider's school, in their spider's school. Yeah, that's cute. Very cute. Almost like, you know, that could be a children's book, right? I think, um, Helga, you should write a children's book. That would be that would be interesting. So you can, you should do it. You can do your, um, you can do an ebook, an Amazon book, and do a children's book. That would be, that'd be a good project. That would be fun. Mean says, when I am not on the plane, I am always, I always see a spider under the chair. When I'm not on the plane, when I, uh, I'm sorry, I mean, I, I read, I'm sorry, one more time. When I am on the plane, and I always saw a spider under the chair. When, when I am on the plane, I always see, because the first part, you didn't put it in past. So we have to continue with the present tense, okay, I mean? When I am on the plane, I, am al I always see a spider under the chair. When I'm on the plane, I always see a spider on the chair. Ava says, I read about spiders, clowns, and schools. Or how about this, Ava? Um, I read about spiders and clowns in school. I read about spiders and clowns in school. I read about spiders and clowns in school. Yeah, in the autumn air, Helga. That's, that's a, um, you should... You should try. You should try to write a children's book. Okay. Let's do group two, shall we? Group two, everybody. Here we go. Group. Group two. Group two. All right. So group two. We have our, our four things are a gun, a dental drill, a needle and blood. Please write a sentence using three of those. Write a sentence using three of those. So let me see my sentence. How am I going to make? My sentence will be the dental drill. He had a gun and a dental drill. Mm. Let's see how some of you did. I'm, let me think about my sentence. Um, uh, the, the needle and dental drill cause blood to appear. The, or we say a, a, a gun and needle caused blood to appear. Something like that. I'm thinking about my sentence. But right now, Marion has a sentence. Yeah, Ava. Good, Ava. Marion, a gun and dental drill or a needle creates unpleasant emotions. Yes. Good one. Good one. Hamad. Good morning. Marion, a gun, a dental drill, and a needle 
or a needle. Sorry, sorry, Marion, I read it wrong. A gun, a dental drill, or a needle creates unpleasant emotions. That is a good sentence for sure. Um, I'm going to say, he had a gun and a needle that caused a lot of blood. <laughs> I don't, I'm still, I don't have a good sentence. Helga says, I am not scared of needles or blood because I can make injections. Good. See, you guys can make better sentences than I can. Rachel, I used a gun to kill the dentist because he used a needle to get my blood. See, you guys have, you guys make better sentences than I can. Rachel, I like it. I'm trying to, I'm trying to think of one too. Um, let's see. Uh, it's hard for me to do both. I'm, lots, I'm looking at the, ch okay, this is hard for me. Sebu says, a man was shot by a gun and he blood transfusion by needle at a, okay, okay, good one, good one. Okay, Sebu, a man was, was shot by a gun. A man was shot by a gun and had a blood uh, and had a blood transfusion by needle at in a hospital a man was shot with a gun okay sebu a man was shot with a gun and had a blood transfusion by a needle in a hospital a man was shot with a gun and had a blood transfusion by a needle in a hospital. Good one, Sebu. Lolly, you can find dental drills, needles, and blood in a hospital, but unfortunately not guns. See, you guys, I'm forget my sentences. Mine are bad. Yours are great. So, um, Lolly not guns okay so perfect sentence just we, we don't say no guns we say not guns fortunately not guns so lolly one more time you can find dental drills needles and blood in a hospital but fortunately not guns umesh i am not afraid of Gun dental drill needle. <laughs> okay. Okay, good. So Sebu fixed her sentence. Shot with a gun and had blood transfu had a blood transfusion by needle in a hospital. Yes, Lolly, not guns. Okay, I still have to write my sentence. I still don't have my sentence. Um I don't, mine's going to be bad. Okay. A man with a gun. A man with a gun used a needle. A man with a gun used a needle to get blood. Uh, that's not a very good sentence. <laughs> that's not a very good sentence. My sentence is my sentence is a man with a gun used a needle to get blood. I don't know. Yeah, okay, good, good, good. Helga says, no guns, needles, dental drills, and blood here. <laughs> right, right, so you'll see like a sign that says, you know, no shoes, no shirts, no service, right? So that means you need to have shoes and a shirt to go into the store. So Helga's slogan is, no guns, needles, dental drills, and blood here. 
Yeah, it is very difficult. Okay, let's go to step three, shall we? Let's do step three. We're going to put it over here. Step three. Now, make eight sentences, all right? We want to make eight sentences because there are eight items, okay? So one item, one sentence, okay? So for example, clowns, one sentence. Spiders, one sentence. School, one sentence. Flying, one sentence. A gun, one sentence. A dental drill, one sentence. A needle, one sentence. Blood, one sentence. So we're using, we're making eight sentences using the vocabulary. Oh, Mary, a doctor found a gun with blood alongside the needle and dental drill. See, you guys, you guys do great sentences. You, you make great sentences. Okay, clowns. Okay, I like, I like clowns. That's good. I like clowns. Okay, two. Good, Ava. Two, spiders. Um, spiders are scary. That's mine. Spiders are scary. Three. Three. School. I, I went, I, I went to school. <laughs> I'm, mine are just super basic. I went to school. Okay. Four. <laughs> Four. Uh, flying. I like flying to America. <laughs> I like flying to America. Five. Five. Um, guns are dangerous. Guns are dangerous. Guns are dangerous. Six. Okay. Okay. Put this up a little bit here. Okay. So we're, we are um, making sentences with all eight. Let's see, Lolly, when I was a child, clowns made me laugh, but not any more now. Marion, clowns are very good actors. Ava, I don't like spiders. Helga, it's a pity there is no Radu here. He doesn't like spiders. Yeah, Radu has been absent the last week, right? He, he wasn't here this week, or last week, I should say, last week. So where is Radu? Well, today's Monday, so maybe Radu will be back tomorrow on Tuesday, our regular day. Uh, Lolly says, I am afraid of spiders. Umesh, spiders are dangerous. They can bite us. Marion, spiders are great master weavers. Rachel, I have a gun. Gosh, clowns enter entertain people in circuses good good gosh clowns entertain people in circuses Eva I went to school many years ago yes Sebu uh, the clown in the movie Joker is impressive have you seen this movie yes I have yeah it's a very kind of down movie it's very dark right it's a dark movie Mary says, clowns make me laugh. Umesh, schools provide education. I like to go to school to learn English. Oh, Dalva, hello. Marion, when I hear the sound of a dental drill, my adrenaline rushes. Yeah, Dalva, you're late. We are almost finished. Delva. Right now we're making um, sentences 
based on these vocabulary words. Clowns, spiders, school, flying, guns, dental drills, needles, blood. We're making sentences. Eight. One of each. Ah, so a web, Mary. Spiders make a web all day. A web. Oh, Umesh, flying is convenient. I like it. Marion, the children, the children's school is closed to home. It's close to home. Good, good, Marion. The children's school is close to home. Very good. Okay, Mai says, I'm afraid of spiders. Gosh, I like to go to school to learn English. Very good. Lolly, I want to fly to Japan to... Oh, I want to fly to Japan and visit you, Mark. Mwah. Come on, Lolly. Come on. You can do it. Come on, Lolly. You can do it. It's easy. Just go buy a ticket. It's easy, Lolly. Just go buy a ticket. <laughs> you can do it. Good night, Dash. Esther, I don't like to see blood flow. Me too. Yes, I'm afraid of... I don't like to see blood. Yeah. Marion, today I'm flying to London. Lucky, Marion. Guns protect us from enemies. Yes, Umesh. Police officers and bad men wear guns. Very good, Lolly. Ava, I don't like dental drills and needles too. Very good, Delva. Oh, okay, good. You're reading all the, the, the chats. Very good. Very good, Delva. Like I always say, lots of great English in the chat, right? Lots of great English in the chat. Oh, what is my blood type? I am, I keep, I, I'm B. No, I'm O. I'm type O. Type O. How about you? So, Sewu, what's your blood type? My blood type is O. I got blood many times. Oh, you mean I gave blood many times. So you give blood, right? I give blood. Doctors operate dented drill. Oh, the doctors used a dental drill on me. How about that, Umesh? The dentist used a dental drill on me. The dentist used a dental drill on me. Okay, Choki says, police had arrested two people after they were, after they were death by gunshot. Okay, okay, uh, Choki, police had arrested two people after they shot someone. Two po police arrested two people after they shot someone. After they shot someone. Oh, Delva says, I'm afraid of flying and snakes. Helga, it's strange fashion to invite clowns to a children's birthday. <laughs> Marion, um, which do you prefer, a syringe needle or a bee needle? Ah, syringe needle, for sure, Marion. <laughs> for sure, yeah, no, I, I prefer the, the, the needle you get at the doctor's office. Okay, Ava. Oh, I'm O. I don't know what if I'm positive, or, but I'm O. Okay, Sewu is A. So Ava, we have the same blood type. Air Lady, the drill, the drill injured my mouth a couple years ago. The dentist did stop because of the blood. Oh no, Air Lady, that's a terrible story. That's too bad. Oh, okay, Mary. My flight departs at 8 o'clock. Okay, here we go, Mary. My flight departs at 8 o'clock. Lolly, I give injections to my patients, but I don't like to be injected. 
<laughs> so, so you like to do it, but you don't like it done to you. Hold on, I have to. No spamming, please. No spamming, please. Okay. Um, let's see. Dalva, I, I don't ride. I don't fly on a plane because I'm afraid my heart will stop beating. Okay, good, Delva. I don't fly on a plane. So we say fly on a plane. We don't fly. I don't fly on a plane because I'm afraid my heart will stop beating. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, we're almost, okay, I'm looking at the clock. So let me write my eight. Guns are dangerous. Number six, a dental drill. Um, a dental drill is noisy. A dental drill is noisy. Seven, let's see, seven is a needle. The doctor used a needle. The doctor The doctor used a needle. Number eight, blood. It's good to give blood. It's good to give blood. Okay, those are my eight sentences. Okay, let's see, Air Lady, you you need to make an appointment because the drill cut you need make another oh, oh okay ah yes i need to make other appointment because the drill cut oh okay i have to make oh okay <laughs> air lady you need to make an you need to make another appointment because mm, I'm not sure. Okay, I think it's just Air Lady. You should you should just say um, you need to make another appointment. You need to make another appointment. Oh, so O O type are cool. Lolly O type blood type O blood people are cool type O people are cool and type A people are sensitive Dalva I don't fly on planes because I'm afraid my heart will stop beating okay Dalva one more time I don't fly on planes I don't fly on planes because I'm afraid my heart will stop beating I'm afraid my heart will stop beating. Good, Lolly. Giving blood can save a lot of people. Do it. There you go. Good, Air Lady. I need to make another appointment. Very good, Air Lady. Okay, Marion. Blood donation is a noble act towards our fellow men. Very good, yes. Great sentences, everyone. Well, I have to go now. We are actually, I'm over time. I'm over time. So everyone, great job. We did this. We did the um, worksheet. We talked about phobia. We used these vocabulary items. We used these vocabulary words many times, right? So I think we did a good job. We understand these words. We know how to use these words in a sentence. So you guys did very, very good and well done. Yes. So let's go for today. Let, let's go for now. But tomorrow, I will be back tomorrow. Yes, Tuesday at 5 p.m. So the time is different. So I will, I will be back on Tuesday, August 
24th at 5 p.m. Japan time. 5 p.m. Japan time. Tomorrow on Tuesday, August 24th. Okay, so I hope to see you. I hope to see you here back again. So please come back tomorrow and let's do it again. Okay. Uh, Lolly, you need to cure anemia. Okay. Thank you, Delva. Thank you, everyone. Helga, you can choose a nightmare. Okay, you can choose a nightmare. A gun, a needle, a dental drill, or a big spider. Okay, I will choose... Oh, that's a hard one. I will choose a big spider. <laughs> Thank you, Air Lady. Thank you for joining, Air Lady. Thank you for your kind support. I really appreciate it. Um, Thank you, Marion. Yeah, thank you, Green Team. Mwah. Thank you so much for becoming a Green. Uh, thank you for joining the channel and supporting me and the channel. I really appreciate it. And um, thanks, everyone, for spending your time with me. I really appreciate it. Um, okay, good. Air Lady, today is um, not my usual time because right now I'm on summer break, so I have some free time now, but in September I can't. Okay, so um, everyone, please come back tomorrow. I will see you tomorrow. So let's say goodbye. Let's count down to saying, thank you, Air Lady. Mwah. Big kiss, big kiss. So let's count down. Thank you, Air Lady. So let, let's count down to saying goodbye, shall we? Here we go, here we go, count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, thanks everyone. Thank you so much. I will see you tomorrow. I will be back here tomorrow, 5 p.m. Japan time. Okay, so please come back. Take it easy. Bye.